¿Qué dice? Good evening. Hello, people. Hi, teacher. Hi, good to see you. Good well, I can see only Gabriel. <laughs> now I can see Fatima, Alberto. <laughs> only three cameras. Guys, remember, it's important to turn on your camera, okay? To have it on. Thank you, Amalia. Thank you, Selena. Because in that way, when you have your camera on, I can see if you are understanding the topic. I can see your face like, yes, I understand, or mm, it's not so clear. So that's why it's important to have the camera on. And you have a beautiful smile. <laughs> you have a beautiful smile, Fatima Yosemi. <laughs> So, in Amalia, too, Selena, you see, I want to see your faces. <laughs> Imagine one day in the supermarket, I see you, you will recognize me, but I won't recognize you because I never see your face. <laughs> well, okay, so today is our class number. What number is our class? Eleven class. Exactly, it's the class number eleven. Very good. And today is Friday, June ninth, twenty twenty three. Exactly, and this is the class eleven. Okay. By the end of the class, you will learn about common breakfast foods in different countries. Additionally, you will practice a conversation which illustrates some cultural differences in food. Well, this is very important because when you travel to other countries, when you visit other countries, you find out that there are not tortillas, there are not pupusas, there are not tamales in other countries, right? People eat different foods. So we are going to learn about that. And also, we'll continue practicing about adverbs of frequency when talking about food. Okay, so let's see. <clears throat> we have the recall in previous class, adverbs of frequency, different breakfasts around the world, and wrap up. Okay, to review the previous class, we, we have these exercises, and you are going to help me to check if it's true or false. So you need to pay attention. You need to look at the fridge. You need to look at the refrigerator. Okay, the different food here. What food can you see? <coughs> what food can you see? 
Okay. Oranges. Oranges. Strawberries. Carrots. Berries, carrots. Apples. <clears throat> Celery. Celery. Corn. Lemon. 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 What is this? To make Cucumber. a salad? Cucumber. Cucumber. Cucumber, yes. And this is? Onions. Apple. An apple, yes. Uh, apple. And? Juice. Juice, no. right? Okay. So, there are some celery. True or false? True. True. There Ooh. isn't an apple. Uh, false, false. 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 Oh. Because there is an apple. It's, it's here. A... It's okay. green, but there is an apple. There's <clears throat> a big root. There's a big root. Mm. Beetroot. 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 Okay, do you like Russian salad? Potato and beetroot, and it's pink. A uh, salad, the beetroot is to make uh, the potato salad, the Russian salad. Ah, remolacha. Remolacha. Yes, do you see a beetroot? There's a beetroot here. True. True. One. Well, it looks like I think uh, it's yes. yeah. Okay, so there are some so pears. Pears. False. False. There aren't any strawberry. True. 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 There are false. No, false. 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 No. There are some lemons. True. True. There are some carrots. True. There aren't any oranges. False. False. Great job. Great job. Okay. So I, I can see that you remember. Okay, guys. Now. You had an activity, you had an assignment. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Okay. Oops, what is it? I put it here. Ah oh, yeah. Time to present. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to take the attendance right now so you can review your notes, right? Just before uh, you before you present in front of the class. So I'm going to take the attendance. Please say present teacher or here, yeah. Alba Yoselin Romero Lara. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm so sick. Alba Yoselin. Present teacher. Oh, okay, and just on time. Amalia Beatriz Tobar. Present teacher. Thank you, Amalia. Ana Julia Flores de Cetino. Present teacher. Thank you, Anderson Emanuel Palomo Portillo. Anderson Emanuel. Arely Janet Cornejo. Arely Janet. No, yes. Brenda Dimas. Briseida Janet Garcia. Briseida Yarisa. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Bris. Carlos Adolfo García. Carlos. Present teacher. <laughs> Carlos Manuel Velázquez. <coughs> Carlos Manuel. Eh, <coughs> sorry, guys. Carolina Elizabeth. Aquí está. Um, Selena Yasmin. <clears throat> Present teacher. Cindy Fabiola Molina. Present teacher. Okay. Claudia Carolina Cruz. Present. Cristian Josué Leiva. Present. Okay. Daniel Enrique Ayala. Daniel Enrique Ayala. 
Daniel Quijano Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Good, Daniel. Edith Carolina. Edith Carolina. Eduardo Enrique Vázquez. Eduardo Vázquez. Elsa Noelia Portillo. Present. Erika Noemí Hueso. Stephanie García Ángel. <coughs> Evelyn Janet Rivera. Present. You, Fátima Jocelyn Portillo de Roa. Fátima Jocelyn, Gabriel Isaac Guevara. Present. Thank you. Gabriela Alexandra López Borja. Present. Thank you, Gabriela. Gerardo Arturo Guzmán. Gerardo Arturo. <coughs> Jacqueline Beatriz Vigil. Ginny Lizera Escobar Lucero. Present. Thank you, Ginny. And Jose Heriberto Durán Prado. Present teacher. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for your attendance and time. No, Fatima, we didn't hear you. <laughs> Fatima Jocelyn, por Dio. Okay. Good. So, well, Y no me mencionó, teacher, o no sé si yo no escuché. Yeah, I mentioned yeah. your name. Arely Janet Cornejo. Sí, no, pues no le escuché. Tenía bajito el audio. Ah, ok. Daniela Ayala. Daniela Ayala has problems. Ok, Daniela Ayala. And, Arely, and let's see, the other person is Elsa. Elsa Noelia. Por tío. <coughs> yes, I could hear you, Elsa. It's here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks. Remember that every minute is very important. Every minute of connection is very, very important for uh, the report, the report to Infafor, so that you can continue with the benefit of having the free English class. Okay. So people, I need uh, that you can volunteer to start with the conversation. We are eager to hear. This is my favorite part of teaching when I listen to the students speaking English. So who is going to start? Who is going to break the ice? Tell me, I have a cough. <coughs> So you need to speak in this class today. About uh, the list of ingredients. Yes, and the conversation. Yes. Okay. Gabriel. Uh, I read our conversation. And who is your partner, Gabriel? Uh, my partner is Briseida uh, with uh, and Fatima. <coughs> Briseida Yarisa and Fatima. <coughs> okay, I think Briseida, I think she's not going to be able uh, to, to help uh, you. But maybe Fatima, por ti. Uh, uh, Fatima? But, 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 I, but I read the, the, the conversation. But it's the conversation between the two people. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, with Fatima. Yeah, with Fatima. Fatima Jocelyn. Ah, she has problems with the audio. Okay, in that okay. case, Gabriel, you will have to read the conversation. Okay. Very good. Uh, I need to buy... Um, all right. I'll start. Begin, begin. Uh, this conversation uh, is uh, about the three people uh, to buy the ingredients. The one and two and three uh, people. 
the one uh, I need to buy some flour of rice, but uh, but don't need any salt. Uh, the people number two, we need to buy a lot of tomatoes, but we don't need any carrots. The people three, I can give you some lorocos uh, because I have in my house. And uh, the people one. Let's go to the market to buy some onions and cabbage. And the number two. And we can add any vineyards and cheese. And the number three. We need to buy some carrots, but don't buy oil because my mother has in the kitchen. And the 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 it is the food. The food. Oh, the, 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 pardon, the food is pupusas. You are going to make pupusas. Wow, for all the class, please. Cheese and loroco. I want some pupusas. Yes. Cheese and loroco. <laughs> Thank you, Gabriel. Please, an okay. applause for Gabriel. He was the first one. Thank you. <laughs> Very good. In the reactions, you can put the applause. Very good, okay. I guess there was a problem with Zoom. Good, so who is next? Me teacher. Jimmy, okay, and who is your partner, Jimmy? My partner is Christian Leiva. Christian, okay, after you, in Christian, uh, we have Heriberto in company. Okay, okay. Gigi and Christian, lights, camera, action. Jenny, do we make tacos for dinner? Good idea. Let's get some tortillas for it. Do you have some tomatoes and onions? I have some tomatoes, but don't have any onions. We need to go to the supermarket. Okay, what do you we need to buy? We need buying meat, some tortillas, and some onions. I, I, like, I like tacos with avocado and hot chili. Really? We let's buy some? Do we need some cilantro too? Yes, let's go to the supermarket for buy it. Let's go. Finish the chair. Very nice. We make tacos for dinner. <laughs> let's make tacos. I love tacos too. And I was looking for the tacos emoji, but I didn't find it. <laughs> I had some hamburger pizza fries, but no tacos, but excellent. Sounds very delicious. <laughs> Good job. Okay, next, Heriberto, and who is your partner, Heriberto? Uh, my partner is uh, Carlos and Claudia. Carlos and Claudia. Hello. Yes. And Claudia, where Claudia? is Claudia? Claudia. Oh, yes. Hello. <laughs> hey, Claudia. Hello. Okay. Hello. Hi, guys. Hi, eh, Claudia and Carlos. Hello, Alberto and Claudia. How are you? Fine. Hello, hello, Carlos and Alberto. Fine. Um, today we made some beef and some chicken tacos for lunch. Uh, my friends, uh, do they like tacos? Yes, I like beef tacos with some onions and tomatoes. I love tomatoes and onions. Yes, I like chicken tacos and sometimes I uh, eat beef tacos. Okay, so let's go to the supermarket buy uh, and beef and chicken and other ingredients for make uh, tacos. Okay, I prepared tacos, but I need some beef, chicken, and some tomatoes and onions. I don't have oil and cilantro, 
and cilantro. Also lemon to chimol, but I have tortillas. I don't. I don't need any cheese. Okay. okay. I need it. Some tacos for lunch. I also want tacos for lunch and some time for for dinners on weekends. Okay, guys, I cook. I cook the tacos in the oven for the minutes. After five minutes, I take the tacos out of, of the oven. Later, I put the tacos in the table. Then everyone puts the other ingredients. For example, tomatoes and some onions. Finally, we can drink soda or coffee. Okay, my friend, thank you. Thank you, guys. Are thank delicious. You. Very thank good. You. you were very specific with the ingredients, with the procedure, the process of making tacos. Very good. Thank you for your participation. Okay, who goes next? Who goes next? Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Selena, can you go next? Okay, Edith, Edith, you raise your hand. Hello, teacher. Who is your partner, Edith? Good evening. Mm -hmm. Daniel and Elsa. Daniel Quijano and Elsa Noelia. Okay. Okay. Elsa, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Lights. Camera. Action. Hello, guys. Hello. Hello, Daniel. Hello, Noelia. Hello, Edith. Hello. Um, let me make some pupusas. Okay, Noelia. Hi. Okay, what do we need to buy? Uh, no, I'm sorry. Hi, good evening, teacher and classmate. We are going to make pupusas. Uh, what we do need to buy? We need to buy cheese, some tomatoes, some onions, <clears throat> greens, chilies, some garlics, a cabbage, also some carrots, a purple onion, green paper, Vinegar and oregano. My classmate we, is going to continue. Uh, we we have caramel beans, salt, and water oils, but I don't have pulpy onions, vinagre, and oregano. We need uh, ingredients and cheese, some tomatoes, some sunios, green chills, some girls, uh, cabais, also some carrots, a purple onion, green pepper, vinagre, and oregano. Okay. So, ready, where, uh, what we, we need? No, she broke it. Making. <laughs> we need to be to to. We need beans, salt, uh, oil, and okay. water. Salt, okay. corn, beans, cheese. Yes. This is all, teacher. 
Okay, thank you. Thank you for your participation. <laughs> okay, you are going to make a good curtido, right? Or pickled vegetable. <laughs> okay, who goes next? Next. Everybody will present. Selena, Amalia, Cindy, Selena. Okay. Remember? La, Class. La the conversation. La question. Okay. This Kate, we need sugar for the lemonade. And then, if so, let's get a pound. Kate, um, sound go to the we. We also need a lot of lemon. Jane will fill a hood with water to make the lemonade. Um, Jane, Kate, I think it's a good idea. He'll prepare the lemons to make the lemonade. Jane, um, all right, let's do it. Ay, yo ahí hay este pancake, heat, eh, flowers, eh, milk, preparar mi brother, eh, tea, tea, chai with milk, never cappuccino, I love, I never. Eh, remember. Eh, the shopping supermarket, eh, onions, garlic, tomato, potato, oil, eh, corn fry, eh, let's go, never. No okay. remember. Thank you, Amalia and Selena. <laughs> okay, so Selena made a conversation about making lemonade and Amalia about pancake, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was supposed to be a conversation between the two of you, right? Mm -hmm. Prepare a thinking about the ingredients you need to buy for the food. But it was okay. Thank you, Amalia and Selena. Let's see who is next. Remember, your participation is very important. Ana Julia, Areli, Cindy, Gabriela, Evelyn, Daniel, Brisey, Dayane, Daniel. Okay. <clears throat> Who is next? Jeannie, did you pass already? Did you pass? Ya pasó? Did you pass? Yes, teacher. Okay. I second. Second group. Sorry, I didn't remember. Okay, somebody else? Areli, Evelyn, Ana Julia, Elsa, Daniel. Well, guys, remember participation is important. The more you participate, you will learn more English, right? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, because practice makes perfect. Um, as I was listening to your conversations, I have some observations about pronunciation, for example. How do you pronounce this word? Idea. Idea, excellent. Idea. Invento, yes. <laughs> Everybody please say, idea. 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 I have an idea. Yeah. I have, I have an idea. idea. That's a good idea. A good idea. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Okay, the next okay. word is cabbage. 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 Yes. Cabbage. cabbage. We need we need some cabbage. We need, we, some cabbage. 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 we need some cabbage. Cabbage. We need some cabbage. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. Pollo. Okay. Yes. Vinegar. 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 Yes. Vinegar. Put some vinegar to the cabbage. Put some vinegar to the cabbage. Okay, um, vinegar the words. Then we have in English this is oregano. <laughs> oregano. 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 <laughs> and then the tea. Oregano. Chai tea. Chai, chai tea. tea. Yes. Chai tea. Chai tea. Chai tea. tea. I love a chai tea. You love chai tea. You always drink. Chai tea. <laughs> chai tea. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for practicing. Good. Now, guys, we are going to continue with the class I have prepared for you this evening. And, well, in the next slide, in a moment, you will see a conversation. <coughs> you will see a conversation. The conversation is, we always have green tea and we have a conversation between Eva and Kaito. So I need two volunteers to read the conversation. Hi, teacher. Okay, Christian and Edith, please. You will start, Edith. Okay. What is that? Typical Japanese breakfast skate. Well, we usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Oh, it's really good. Sometimes we have a salad, but we never have coffee. Really? What do you have? We always have green tea. Green tea. Mm. I love green tea. Listen, my family usually have a Japanese style breakfast on weekends. We don't you come to my house on Sunday. That's very nice of you. Thanks. Thank you, Christian and Edith. So they are talking about what type of breakfast? What type of breakfast? Salvadorian, American, or Japanese breakfast? Japanese. Japanese. Yes. Is the same? Is it the same as Salvadorian breakfast? No, not never. No. Very different. What do Japanese people eat? Fish. Bread. Fish and green tea. Egg. And green tea and soup. And soup. <laughs> in the soup. breakfast, yes. So Eva says fish and rice. And soup. That's interesting. Oh, it's That's really soup. good. Sometimes we have a salad too, but we never have coffee. So Japanese people mm. never drink coffee. Never. Really? What do you have? We always have green tea. I love green tea. Okay, so if you notice, they are using adverse of frequency. For example, in the first one we have, 
we usually have fish. Sometimes we have a salad. We never have coffee. We always have tea. My family usually has a Japanese style breakfast. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Okay. So we can see here the different uh, adverbs of frequency. Now, this is just a review of what we studied yesterday. Remember the, the order, subject, adverb of frequency, and verb. So we're going to practice. You have to put the adverbs in the correct place. So please type it in the chat. In the chat, you're going to type uh, the sentence or question in, with the adverb of frequency. For example, in the first, do you, do you have a big breakfast? You have to use usually, so you're going to write. You're going to type, do you usually do you usually a, have a big breakfast? Do you usually have a big breakfast? Well, on Sunday, I have a, I, mm -hmm. okay, type it please, type it in the chat. I have usually, okay. The sentence with the, Albert Adelie, you're sleepy. I see, yes. <laughs> okay, Carlos, the, the position will be on Sunday, I always have. Okay, I think we have to do it together. <laughs> okay, so it's well, on Sunday, I, I always, I always. Okay. Always. I always have a big breakfast with my friends. Amen. I always. You, okay. okay. <clears throat> In question, you. you use ever. Don't you know? Do you ever? Do ever eat breakfast at work on weekday? Do you ever, it's like, do you always? It's similar to do you always eat breakfast at work on weekday? Yes, I. Always. Sometimes. Sometimes. I sometimes have breakfast at the office restaurant. Do you often do you often eat breakfast at your desk? No, no, I hardly ever eat breakfast. I hardly ever eat breakfast at my desk. Uh, Eriberto, no some no, never in question. We don't use never in questions. Do you ever work on weekends? Do you ever? <coughs> okay, thank you. <coughs> we use ever in question. Okay? Yeah. So remember the structure, subject. Yeah. What is name? Advert of frequency. And? Okay. frequency plus fair. We are going to practice, guys. Tell me about something. Okay, I will 
type here the, let me see, the, the adverb of frequency, and you will write a sentence with that adverb of frequency, okay? The adverb of frequency is never. Make sentences with never, please. Sentences with never, you can open your microphone or you can type it in the chat. Sentences or with never. I never going to. Okay, um, Carlos has, I never eat seafood. <laughs> Good. More examples? I never run in the morning. <laughs> okay. You never eat alone, Edith. You never go to the stadium. And now it's dangerous. to watch a soccer game in the stadium. I have a, a, one, my example. I never call people at midnight, right? I never call people at midnight. <coughs> okay, Kristen, you never go to the pool. Oh, Gabriel, sería, I have never been in Europe. I have never been in Europe. I never play soccer in the morning. Okay, Heriberto. But it's not a question, it's an affirmation. Very good. Okay, now the next is the opposite of never. What is the opposite of never? What's the opposite of never? Remember, never is zero percent. Always. 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 Let's write sentences with always. Okay, guys, give me one minute. Continue writing the, with always and sometimes. I will get some medicine for my throat, okay? So I will leave you here. Nice. I always, I'm sorry. I will mention your name and you read your sentence. Dini? Dini, can you read your sentence, please? I, I always go to the park on weekend. Carlos García. I always visit my parents on weekend. On weekend. Gabriel Guevara. No, oh, Gabriel. Sería I always have. Or I always eat. 
-hmm. Can you read the correct sentence? Gabriel, can you read your sentence? Please. The next, the next, uh, I always to get up at, at 6 a.m. Okay, you always get up at 6 a.m. Uh, Christian Josue. I always go to the school. Edith. I sometimes eat salad. I sometimes, don't forget the S. I sometimes. I sometimes. Eat sometimes. Salad. Sometimes. Yes. I sometimes eat salad. <laughs> okay, Edith, try to work on the S, okay, with the pronunciation, because when you pronounce the S in English, you sound better. Okay, Areli Cornejo. Areli. I never work on weekend. I never work on weekend. In on yes. week. Weekends. Weekend. Weekends. Mm -hmm. With the S. Weekends. I never work on weekend. weekend. On weekend. <laughs> yes. Gabriel, sin el two. I always get up. I always get up. Elsa Noelia. Yes. I I I always no, I usually go shopping on Saturday. Yes. yes. Ana Julia. I always go to the playa twice a year. Mm, how do you say playa in English? Beach. Beach. Ah, oh, okay. Ana beach. Julia. <laughs> beach. Okay. Okay, say it again. I always go to the beach twice a year. I always go to the beach twice a year. Excellent. There you go. <laughs> Selena? I never visit my grandmother and I always visit my grandmother. Okay, good. Now the next will be rarely, rarely. My example, I rarely sleep until 9 a.m. Edith, you rarely visit your friends. Mm -hmm. Oh, Carlos, you rarely go to a tree. Okay, well, I will read your name and you read the sentence, okay? Gabriel Guevara. Gabriel. Read. Mm -hmm. Please. I rarely go to the hospital. Wow, you're a healthy person. I often go to the hospital. <laughs> yes. Jeannie. I rarely drink soda. Wow, you are very healthy too. It's better to drink water. Oh, 
Okay, the next is hardly ever. You can also use the third person singular with my mother, my father, my brother, my sister, my son, so that you can practice the third person singular. Good, Elsa. Okay. Casi nunca. My example, my husband hardly ever dances in Paris. He doesn't like dancing. So he hardly ever dances. Only when he when he likes the music. Okay, Arely. What's your example, Arely? Arely, can you read your example? I rarely rest at home on the weekend. Oh, yes, because at home we have more work. Llega la chacha. Okay, Carlos. My mom rarely goes. Goes shopping dresses. Goes shopping dresses. Okay. Now the next frequency adverb is often. Often. Yes. Goes shopping dresses. Goes shopping. Delete the two. It's not necessary oh, to use two. Go shopping. Okay. Did hardly ever. I hardly ever go to the cinema. My mother rarely goes shopping. Yes, that's correct, Carlos. Amen. Okay, often. This is my example. My cat often asks for food. Meow, meow. <laughs> my cat often asks for food, right? <laughs> Oh, that's good, Carlos. You open cook breakfast. Great. Okay. Um, we just have a couple of more minutes. Oh, she often goes to the beauty salon. I often visit my mom. Okay. Now, in the next slide, guys, we are going to unscramble the sentence and put them in order. So you are going to tell me. For example, the first is, I hardly ever have beef for lunch. Okay, what about number two? I never eat a snack when... Oh, no. I never eat yes. snacks when, when watch TV. I watch TV. When I watch TV, very good. Number three. Uh, sometimes, sometimes I sometimes eat, 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 for, eat eggs for eggs for breakfast. For eggs. Eggs, for for breakfast. Uh, four. I usually have dinner with my family. family. My family. Oh, very good. No, I 
Excellent. So if you notice subject, frequency adverb, verb. Subject, frequency yes, adverb, so I'm verb. I'm subject, frequency adverb is verb. Very good. Okay. Okay, now guys, you can tell me the answer of these questions. Any person, volunteer? Do you always have a big breakfast? Any person? Two questions. Uh, two questions about missing habits. Number one, yes. number one. Do you always have a big breakfast? Yes, I do. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, yes, I'm good. Number two, mm, I'm gonna ask directly. Let's see. Uh, Christian, Christian Josue. What time do you usually have lunch? Twelve. I usually have lunch. Mm, one o'clock. Okay, can you say the complete sentence? I usually have lunch at one o'clock. I usually have lunch at one o'clock. Thank you, Christian. Very good. Mm, Selena. Selena Yasmin, what do you usually have for lunch? I usually have for lunch around. Selena? Orange juice. And three. Yes. What do you usually have for lunch? I usually have. Um, has. I usually have. I usually have. Um, for lunch. For lunch. Um, fish. Really? Yes. Okay, only fish, or do um, you salad, rice, beans? Yes, it's, it's my favorite food. Okay, fish with salad and tortillas. ¿Cómo se dice? Tortillas. Okay, thank you, Selena. Amalia. Do you often have snacks in the afternoon? I often have snacks. No. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, thank you, Amalia. Daniel mm -hmm. Quijano. Okay. Do you ever go to a restaurant for dinner? I... I the, the answer I is ever, yes I do or no I don't. Do you ever go to a restaurant for dinner? Yes, yes I do. Oh, okay. And the last question. Any volunteer? Gabriel What's something you never eat for dinner? <laughs> I, I never eat for dinner fish. Okay, you never eat fish for dinner. <laughs> Very nice. Good. Excellent. Well, guys, um, we don't have enough time to continue with this, but we'll do it on one day. But I need you to do something for next Monday. This is going to be individually, individually, okay? Individual work. You are going to investigate about 
a breakfast uh, in a, from another country. This is an example. Well, I put here good afternoon, but it's not good afternoon. It's good evening. Uh, today, I'm going to talk about what people in Italy eat for breakfast. Italian people eat coffee, biscuit, cereal, orange juice, etc. Okay, so you are going to investigate what people in another country eat for breakfast. Could be United States, Guatemala, Brazil, Spain, Russia, Ukraine, China, um, Singapore, uh, Israel, Canada, Alaska, okay? So that's going to be your homework for Monday. Yes, Gabriel? Yes, Gabriel, what is your question? How many countries? One country. One. Oh, only one? Only, only one. one. Oh, okay. And you can put some pictures, please. Put some pictures. Oh. You can prepare a slide. Okay. Oh, only, only breakfast? Only the breakfast. Mm -hmm. Okay. What people mm. usually eat for breakfast. Okay, guys, it's time to go. I need to go right now. But I will send this to you later. Thank you for connecting. Just quickly, the people who came late, I think it was Anderson, Brenda Dimas, Briseida Yanet, Briseida Yanet. Is she present or not? Uh, she's there, but she can't speak. <laughs> okay, Eduardo Enrique? Eduardo? Not present. Erika Noemi? Stephanie Angel? Gerardo Arturo? Jacqueline Beatriz? Okay, thank you for coming to the class. See you. On Monday. Okay, good night. Have a nice weekend. Good night. See you. Good night, teacher. Good night. Thank you. Bye.